differential susceptibility is a fairly new concept that refers to individual differences in how we respond to the environments that we are exposed to. Susceptibility is a fancy word for sensitivity, so basically it refers to the notion that some people are more sensitive to experiences they make than other people do. Um, so a high sensitive or high susceptible individuals, they'll be more negatively affected by the negative experiences they make, but they will also be more positively affected by positive experiences they make. Whereas those that have a low degree of sensitivity or susceptibility are generally less affected by both. So now my counsel is, what you should tell people pediatricians, counselors, neonatologists, that some kids have more difficult temperaments, but they are much more malleable clay in your hands. They are going to thrive and flourish if you care for them well, more so than others. But they are going to suffer and go down if you care for them poorly. So you are much more, it seems, of the conductor of this orchestra in those cases than in other cases. But will that get through? Will people embrace this? Time will tell.